Hi everyone, so sorry if you can't hear me out because my phone's got really low like um, volume on it, I don't know why. So my voice sounds a bit quiet for some reason because the audio isn't that good on my phone. But I'm going to be showing you my aftermarket hubcaps and yeah, there's a lot of them. This is not all of them, there's about five or six more. But those ones, are, those ones are at my mum's house because I left the best ones at my mum's house because... I just well I just did I don't want to I don't want to say why but I just did so um I want, these are all my aftermarkets right here all the way up here just even all those there might be a couple of aftermarkets um, genuine in here but they're they're genuines um so there's probably about 150 here this is about a fifth of my collection maybe maybe it's about 80 odd caps here I don't know but I'm just showing you them so this first up is a 15 inch Richmond uh no yeah 15 another 15 inch Richmond. Uh, one of these ones, I don't know what that one is. Uh, another Richmond. Um, oh, there's a spider there. Um, this one, Richmond again. Most of my Richmonds are, are here because they were in se they were separated in piles. I just got, got the piles from over there and just chucked them here. So that's why they're in sort of groups. Uh, Richmond and Richmond. I had like four or five of these four bolts, 14 inch ones, but some of them broke. Not too fast though. Um, Milwaukee, right there, and there's another one, I've got one of these as well, those ones, I like these ones actually, they're quite nice, um, I wouldn't mind having one of those on my, um, my car when I grow up, I actually have loads of favourite cars I really want to have, so I have so many that I've, I'm probably only going to have like a, my, one of my favourite cars is a Fiat 500, or a Ford Ka. I don't know, like the old Ford Ka. I don't know why, it just is, there's a Renault aftermarket, there's another one right here. This is a beautiful one. I love this one. Um, five bolt one. This one is the one. No, it's not. Well, I, this one I did not find in the car park. This one I did. Here we go. So it's the black version of those ones. The black versions I'm not too fussed about. But look, look, look at these clips. They're really, they really look brittle. Look, they're like really, they're really brittle. So I have to be careful of this one. Um, another one of these ones. Um, I've got about, I used to have three or four of those, but, um, yeah. We also had a set of those on my dad's van, but he lost all of them. So, yeah. Um, this one, I, lo I like this one, actually. I found, I saw one of these about six months ago, back in October or whenever it was. And, um, it was on a roundabout and I couldn't get it. I think it was, I think it looked like it was a, like a, um, like a, um, old, it looked like it had been, like, repainted. Because it looked like it was a darker, like a, sort of like a grey colour. But yeah, anyways, it might have been a whole food pain, I don't know, but this, oh, this one, this one is a nice Polish uni, like most of these hubcaps, but this one was bro is broken, unfortunately, but um, this one, I, this one had been in, in the grass over there for so long, I had to pull it out really hard and it was sort of really broke the hubcap. <laughs> uh, one of these hubcaps. I like these ones, actually, but they're quite hard to find, so yeah, these ones, this one's got the really, like, the strong clip it's on this universal and this is a rare platinum version of this i think it's a Volkswagen beetle, beetle copy i don't know really nice one aftermarket nissan this these this inst entire star area can actually come out it has like little clip things on the back uh, there's an aftermarket fiat hubcap which is a an arasho one i think this is 60 now this is a 17 inch version actually isn't it no it's 16 inch this one must be 16 as well. Uh, yes, it is. So there's both 16s. A guy row. I used to have like five or six of these, but not anymore because I threw most of them away because they were just they were chipped and I hate the designs. Um, I actually no. Go back to the rich. Um, not the rich ones. These ones, Arasho ones. I wouldn't mind having one of these on if they were if they're actually proper hubcaps that don't actually always fall off. And the rings obviously come out just there. That's how rubbish they are. Um, I, I would not mind having these in my car. But as they're so rubbish, I'm not going to put them on the car. Even with cable ties. Uh, so this is Sale Universal. Um, one of these Saab copies. I had like four or five of these at one point. But I threw most of them away. Because there was one I had to split through. And the other ones were just bland and not very nice. This one's like the nicer version out of all of them. Because different sizes look a bit different with um, each hubcap. Depends what the design they are. This one is my very first hubcap in my collection, actually. I had another one of these, but it was completely run over, so I threw that one away just after doing my um, my hubcap collection video back in 2017. 
in December, so yeah. Uh, then there's two of these. This one. Now I had I had three of these off my mum's car, but all three of them were really bad condition because they were all chipped and half the clips were missing on most of them. So I threw about all of those away. But these two I found actually, the, like these two, I found. They're, they're both 16 inch as well, the same as what my mum's old car was. So she still had that car, and she had those hubcaps on. I'd put one of these on because yeah, I'm not too fussed on the design. I don't like them much, but yeah. Um, I've got four of these, as you can see, 14 inch, uh, and these were bought for me, so I didn't, I didn't get them. Got them brand new a little while ago, um, black one of these ones, I had a silver one, but that one had a split through the like thin spokes, like these areas, so I threw it away. This one's got a clip snap, I found it in South Wales, no I didn't, but yeah I did, yeah I did, don't matter, I did find it in South Wales. Uh, there's this one from my, my dad's um, old set of hubcaps from about a year ago now. Um, one sec, guys. So, these are not in my collection. But I just wanted to show you these because I got them. They're really bad because they're, they're solid, but they're just a bit wobbly. See, these are, these are like the hubcaps of my dad's van. I thought I'd show you. That one's alright. I thought I'd just show you that. Because I sort of got them and I wanted to have them for my collection if any of them fall off. Oh, that one's a bit off. I don't really oh, that one's off as well, look. Yeah, but I don't care anyways because I'm not going to tamper with them. But um, I thought I'd just show you those because it, they, I, I, bought, I bought them myself, actually. And they sort of classes in my collection if I bought them. I just thought I'd show you them. But I'm not going to put them back on because they're just rubbish universal anyway. Let's get back. <laughs> so, another one. There's I've got three or four of these. I think I had four at one point, but you know, retro universal right here. It's got a chip through it, so if anyone wants this one, I guess I could give it to them. One of this, this one as well. This one's got all clips and a ring, but it's got really bad scratch on the front. Um, universal with a really weird cable tie through it. I didn't do a fine video of this, I don't think, but yeah, it was on a um, one of those mini country roads with like it was really up high on a bank it was sort of like one of those almost vertical banks i sort of found it like that i don't know how it got but it was really hard to get but i got it um mechador this is the version now this one i i think i had a ring when i found it i swear it had a ring but i don't know it's got weird red paint on the, on the thing uh, there's an opus one now when i found this one after I found the video, I thought it was Sundu because it looks like S N D O. It's actually not. That's why I thought it was weird shape. It was like oh, it's open. So there you go. Aftermarket with a chip through it. it. Looks like it was glued at one point, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, Michelin. Not too fast on that one. Um, this Storm one. Now I like I like the, I like these ones, but they just wait. Look, I found two of these. The first one I wanted to smash up because I did. Because they were so common, but um, yeah, they, I've, both of the ones I found of these I found brand new, so that's how rubbish they are. This one's a very nice aftermarket. I wouldn't mind having one of these on my car either. Nice, 15 inch, I think. I'm pretty sure it's 15 inch. Or is it 14 inch? No, it's 15 inch. It's 15 inch. Uh, this one is a taxi-looking one. I had four of these on my mum's car, but this is a 15 inch version. The ones that I had on my mum's car were 16s, and she lost all of them, I think, at one point. Um, retro aftermarket, 14 inch. I didn't do a video of this, but it was the hub um, finders on my Flickr account, my old Flickr account. I don't know if it was on Pojo Guy or Mike Pojo, I don't know. Whatever it was, it's on one of my Flickr accounts. Uh, this one, we were going to get one of these designs, which is the two tone one, which had like these inside bits were sort of. A different like greyish or black colour but we didn't do it because um they didn't come with rings unfortunately because the box had already been opened and I don't know why but it just, that's what it was. Um retro aftermarket it even says 14 inch on the side which is oh, there's a B right above me anyway, it's gone. Here we go. It's got like six clips I think this is a very nice one. I found it about nearly a year ago now. It's 
time flies actually. It, was, it doesn't seem that long ago, but it's actually about almost a year ago. It's 11, 11 and a half months ago. I think in about six days' time, it will be a year ago that I found this. It's a really weird looking one. I love the design. It's like some sort of like retro art market trailer or something or caravan. And um, this one. Now, I found this in absolutely mint condition. This chunk right here. I, I, after I found it, I dropped it on the curb and chipped it off. I, I had the piece somewhere, but it, it fell off somewhere. I lost it. So, yeah, here we go anyways. It's a really lovely retro art market from Autoclass. I, it's just a real shame that the chunk's out of it. I'm, re I'm really I'm beating myself up over it because I really like that one. Um, this one's like a Chrysler copy. Maybe a Chrysler PT Cruiser. I don't know, but it's a really, really not nice design. That's a Sun Universal. Um, I saw one of these on a car the other day and it had just like most of the edge chipped out. It had like most of this edge sort of just chipped away. Um, it was really scratched up as well, so yeah. Anyway, they're really nice. I don't really often see these on vehicles, so it's, there's an ant on it. I don't often see these on vehicles, so it's um, a nice one I found it. It was quite a nice find. Found it on the bridge. I haven't found a hubcap on the bridge for ages because they've actually filled in the potholes. So yeah, uh, another one of these Milwaukee ones. I had two of these, but there was one with missing paint, which I threw away. But it's one of these ones. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't mind having one of these on my car. But the Sun Universal, I wouldn't mind having my car. But this one, I wouldn't mind on the, to have my car either. Uh, this one. Um, I found. I, um, I had one of these given. This not this exact one, because I, I think this one was um, given to me by my cousin at some point. I don't know when. I think about them I had job lot, but I had a few from him, job lots from him, so I wouldn't have an idea. It must have been one of them. So I don't remember finding it or anything. But here it is. It's a two-tone one. Um, this one, which is a aftermarket Mercedes Vito copy. I had a version. I found a version before with the Mercedes badge inside it. B right next to it. Let's get it away from me. Sorry, I've just got a really bad phobia of bees and wasps. So, this one, I had one with a Mercedes badge on it, but I threw it away because I had a little ch chip through it. This one, I absolutely hate this one. But I'm still keeping it because it's a different one and it's a bit odd. I found this one in a... There's a there basically, there was a, it was a, a cul-de-sac because I, I was turning around. Well, my dad was turning around for another hubcap that I saw on the main road and we turned around into a cul-de-sac and turned around... And when we turned around, I saw this hubcap in a car park on the edge of a cul-de-sac, which is really weird, I know, but just watch the video. And when I got it out, it was quite far from the road, so I'm surprised I saw it, but I did, because I was looking out the window at the time. And when I did, I looked at the van next to me, because it looked like the hubcaps were familiar, and it, had, it was one of these hub, those hubcaps on the car, so it must have been removed, but I took it anyways, because it's an aftermarket. Anyway... This one has got some red paint on it. It's a um, Psych Fion, Psych or something like that. I found two of these in one day with both for the Vauxhall badge as well. Um, so, it's a nice one. Uh, this one, I was going to keep this one. It's a 14 inch one, but I have a 13 inch version, which is right there. And I was going to I was going to replace this clip right here because it's snapped off. And the other 13 inch one can go to someone else who I'm trading with. Um, aftermarket. I thought this was a retro uni, but it's actually not. It's got half a missing clip and it's got a little hole for it because they have this weird trend with caravans where they have little holes put into the middle, little wood blocks on the back. I took that off by the way. And yeah, then there's this one. Um, this one's a 16 inch. No, this, oh my gosh, this is a 17 inch one. Jesus, this is a, this is a 17 inch chub cap. Very weird. Never found one of those before, 17 inch aftermarket, but it has all of its clips snapped off unfortunately. Um, it's a really lovely one. This is a Milrado one. Now, um, I found one of these absolutely ages ago. Oh, well, I found a piece of one, but I didn't bother recording it. This one was from a job lot, but I think because I found a piece of one, it was sort of like a um, piece of like the side somewhere, and like the mid part of the middle bit, and I think it's a Peugeot on it or something. So I think it might have been that design. I'm not 100% sure, but that was that was um, given to me, so I didn't get that one. It's also got a scratch on it, which is really weird. Uh, this one is a nice retro uni. These hub this hubcap right here, I put a certain ring on it, and it stayed on the hub on the wheel, and I could barely get it off, and the edges were cutting me. So that's how good these hubcaps are. Even with three missing clips, it was still really tight. I'm not sure how that one fell off. Uh, maybe the original ring was a lot more loose than the other one I put on. Here's a um, 
hook cup right here. It's a um, 13 inch, but I've made it 12 inch because I took the edge off it because I had a huge chunk out the edge. So it looks like a 12 inch hook cup. And so this one. Um, oh, I see a couple of uni hub caps there. I'll do that in a minute. No, never mind. This one's a retro uni. My dad found it, so I didn't find it myself. But when I had, when I when I um got given to me, I had it. It had a huge amount of like algae on it. It's really hard to get off. Uh, this is a cameo. Now this is my one of my I think it's probably my all my all time favourite hub cap. That's retro retro aftermarket hub cap that I've seen. Because this hub cap is amazing. Now this used to never be there. This is a bit of a stone chip there, or whatever it is, or scratch. But it's still a nice one. I really like the design and it's a, it's a beautiful design. It's a really nice one as well. Now this one is a Holt Houston. Now I found a, a lot of these um, at the start of my collection, but pretty much all of them were smashed to pieces. But that was a, that was good, and I found it just outside my housing estate actually, just the road towards my old school. I found it because uh, you had to go out my housing estate, turn left, go about 100 yards, and you'd see it on the left in the bush. So that's where I found it. it looks brand new as well. Uh, this one is a um, another one of these Holford Essentials. Now I wouldn't mind having one of these on my vehicles, but they don't sell them anymore. So if Whenever I get my car, or any other car, if um, whatever the size wheels are, I'll definitely get a, hub, a car with hubcaps, most likely. Um, if I um, change the originals to aftermarkets, I'll have them to these, and I'll maybe give some money for certain ones, for the certain size ones that, that there are, if that makes sense. So this one is um, a really nice one. Now, I think I found it with all clips, but... When I drop, I think I dropped it off my bike, and the, this edge of the end of the clip snapped, half the edge of the clip snapped, and this little middle bit that holds this bit of the ring in snapped. So, but it was completely, it was all complete. I'm pretty sure when I found it. It's a really lovely hubcap. I've only ever seen these on, on old Seat Arosas. I think it's an Arosa, like really old Seat hubcaps. So maybe they are a Seat because they've got a little calendar on the back, but I'm not 100 sure. Oh, this one's a really nice one. Now, a little while, um, not a little while ago, like yesterday or the day before, one of these little things came out. But I put it back in again. I think it might fall out again. I'm not careful. Uh, this one is a uh, Universal again. Another one of those unis. Also got one missing clip. This one, I wouldn't mind having these on my on one of my cars, but only if it's 13 inch, because the other hubcaps that are different sizes of these, this version, look horrible. Um, this one is um, a aftermarket. I didn't like that one. I don't like that one at all. Mega. This one's off a car called Xylem, I think. Now, it's one of the cars I'm looking into for getting, because you can get it when you're 16 and you can get a motor, you can have it with a motorbike, motorbike license. So I'm looking into a car with those hubcaps on. Um, it's called, I think it's called, uh, the marketing company make different cars, sorts of cars and different brands of cars, but the main brand is like Xylem, I think, which is, which is one thing's called one xylem company is called mega which is some sort of like indian company i think i don't know but one of the you can get it with a motorbike license they're like they're like five thousand pounds or whatever so they're really cheap so it's really cool uh, this one's a five spoke one my one of my first hubcaps i found in my collection actually um back in august or september got some chips on it actually but i found it next to a wire electric fence um i think that's the ring to it somewhere i think that's not it's the ring to something else so this one i wouldn't mind having this one on my one of these on my car actually they're really nice hubcaps. They're like a copy of a Suzuki Swift, like an old Suzuki Swift or an old Suzuki Auto. This one's got a um, chip out the side, unfortunately. Well, not a chip, like a crack. It's a nice one. Then these ones, I like. I put this one in the vehicle and I want to I leave it on there. But these hubcaps, I actually like Meridian hubcaps. Like, just forget how common they are. They, they stay on pretty well, actually. And I really like Meridian hubcaps, even though I keep, I hate when I find the 13 inch hubcaps because 13 inch hubcaps, I've only ever found the 13 inch one of these Meridian hubcaps, and there's I found like four or five of those. But um, I'm, I, the design is fine. I'm just tired of finding 13 inch hubcaps, but because it's so common, no, you can see. Okay. Now it's only slipped off like that because it was no groove on this side. But I love these hubcaps, and they're it's really nice. I love, I love Meridians now. I've actually realised that there's a few other hubcaps that are in this pile that are actually aftermarket, so I'll get them out real quick. Both of them were these 12 inch hubcaps. The 12 inch, and I'll prove it, because this hubcap right here, the Meridian, was th is 13 inch, as you can see. <laughs> these hubcaps are a lot smaller, because look, if I put it up against here, they really, they really stay, don't put it up against the rim. They're really, they're 12 inch. 
I don't know what they're off for. Maybe maybe Austin minis. Bit of, I want to get an I, I want to get an original mini. So when I if I get one of those, these will be the hubcaps. If I find four, because I found two of the both of these within about, within about a week of each other. That's quite cool. But uh, yeah, hope you did enjoy. There's my sorry, a crown hubcap. Very nice one. Washed up by the way. So I need to get the all I need to get the, is the badge for it. And um, if, if anyone has a badge for it, that's in decent condition for one of these, I'll give you 15 quid for it, because I really want to have this one with the actual badge. And there's a lovely Fiat 500. I like Fiat 500s for some reason. Yeah, hope you enjoyed, and shit, need a oh, fucking thing. But yeah, goodbye.